Hey friends, this is Alvin. Just wanted to give you a quick April snapshot of what's been happening. First of all, uh, we just came through three months of events, and we are thankful to God for the many things that He has shown us through that time. Uh, we keep on hearing conversations about that people are still having uh, that result that from those events, and we look forward to seeing how God might continue to use those in transforming people's lives. Uh, we also have a couple of up and coming events happening in June. Uh, first of all, Transition 101, which is our event for grade 12 grads. Uh, we're doing this in varsity, Power to Change, AFC, and Navigators. It will be at Wilcliffe College on Saturday, June the 3rd. And so we're inviting the class of 2017 to come out, especially if you're heading out to university in the fall. Uh, come meet some people that you're going to be seeing on campus in, in a few months. And so all the information is at transition101.ca. Also in June, we have our assembly event. Uh, with all of our churches. This is our big family gathering time. And so we encourage you, uh, whether you come in for some of the learning sessions or whether you want to come in for the plenary sessions or even for some of the business meetings, go to baptist.ca slash assembly and find out all the details there. Also, we're excited to co-host something with CBOQ Kids. We're going to be hosting our second annual Real Family Time on Saturday, June the 24th. And so we're going to host this in three locations, in St. Catharines, in Toronto, and in Ottawa. And so if you go to cboqkids.ca slash real with two E's, family time, you'll get more information there. Uh, one of the things that we're excited about is we are going to be previewing, actually we're going to be screening Cars 3. That's coming out on June 16th. And so the weekend after, we're inviting you with your families and maybe even your neighbors to come check out this event with us. For the next couple of months, uh, we'll be planning for next year, and so we would love to have your prayers as we continue to see uh, what God has in store for us in the coming months. You know, most importantly, in the middle of April is Good Friday and Easter. And so during this time, we remember what Jesus has done for us on the cross. We also celebrate his resurrection. And so we hope that during this Easter season, uh, you'll not just remember him and not just reflect on him, but you'll grow deeper in him. Blessings to you.